part two, guys. Sorry, I tried. It's saying connect with the source energy. The Hierophant in this deck is the source energy. Connect with that source energy because this one is a materialist. materialist. It's three-day. It's saying more or less. This is saying bring that energy back from that dimension, from that higher dimension, back to this dimension and create it into reality. But you're going to need to be tapped in so that you don't accidentally manifest the wrong way by the things you're trying to shift and change or the frustrations that you're having. That is their... Because they're saying you're meant to be moving forward, but it's up to you to move forward. Then I am being given... An independence. Independence and hard work. This is the two of coins. The two of pentacles. This is how you create it into tangible reality. Like I said, tap into the hierophant. Bring it forward to you. Source energy in this deck. Connect with it. Bring it back to the third dimension. Taking like magical aspect and bringing it back here is what this means in this deck. And then bringing your independence forward, believing in yourself. Is there one last thing that they need since we had to jump into part two? Forgiveness. Trusting yourself is often harder than trusting in others. Don't worry. If you get it wrong, the consequences will not be as bad as you think. Worthwhile. Life is not about being taught a lesson for getting something wrong. It is about having the experience that adds richness to your life. I think that's pretty much giving you exactly what you might need to hear. Is there anything else? Yeah, I know you're there, but I can't feel it. I mean, I don't know. You're confusing me. What's this one? <laughs> I'm sorry for laughing. Because, Aries, you guys are fire signs and you have an anger problem. Angry. <laughs> anger. Even though you are busting, even though you are burst, bursting inside, you need to remain calm. Dig deep and find the strength to activate your self-control and what lies within. What was I just saying? For me personally, I have come to realize when I am freaking pissed off, my vibrations are at their highest. This doesn't mean that I'm evil. It took me a long time to realize this. That meant that it was time to acknowledge how I honestly felt because I was pissed because it was bad. It was wrong. It wasn't good. It needed to change. And being pissed off meant I had to get honest. Then with the honesty, what's the proper thing? Because you can be pissed off and you can go yell at people. You can go being an asshole. But is that really going to make anything any better? Learn from the anger. Learn from the frustration. What the truth is that's behind the emotional energy. And from that, direct the truth forward by knowing what changes that need to be made. Friendships are fantastic when there is equality in the relationship. Maybe it's time to undertake a quick audit of your own friendships and ensure that they are Receptacle. Make sure that you are consuming the right friends and people, the right energies. What you consume is not just your diet, it's your energy, and it's the friends, the people, the places, and the things. I love you guys. See you next month.